Ah, uh, it is time for Thursday Thunder. Brought to you by our friends at DraftKings Sportsbook. You can follow along on our parlay on the DraftKings Sportsbook app. And I feel like we got a good one this week. I know we say that all the time. We haven't been great recently. I feel like we've been batting like 500 over the last like six of them, maybe. Hit That's really good, though. No, that is good. For parlays, parlays are really parlays tough. Parlays are hard, man. We, and we've done two out of three a lot. So if you want to also bet these individually, yeah. we're, individual we're, stake. we're giving you winning weeks. If like, you know, But these are a parlay. Thursday Thunder. We love our people at DraftKings. I'm going to go first. I've actually been watching some WNBA. Atta boy. And I'm going to go with the Washington Mystics. Mystics, dude. I, I, I love Della Don. I think that they can beat the Chicago Sky. I'm faking this, clearly, with uh, trying to break it down. But that's what I'm going with. We're going with the Washington Mystics. Money line. Atta Tony, boy. what do you got? Uh, we're going to baseball on the diamond. We got Domingo Herman tonight for the Yanks against the... Uh, the Seattle Mariners and uh, Yanks are down. They're they're a dog right now at DraftKings. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the Yankees to win at home, uh, and they are my. I think they're plus one and a half on the run line. So I want to take the Yanks at home plus one and a half on the run line. And Jeremy, let's wrap this up with a little more baseball. This feels like about as big of a lock as could exist. The Tampa Bay Rays. Had lost a few in a row, now won their last game. They've got Shane McClanahan on the bump. He's, he's a monster. Good. Yeah, he's good. Uh, the Kansas City Royals, not good. That's who they're playing. Rays, minus one and a half. That's my pick. I thought you were going to go with the Marlins. We've ruined them. They've lost two in a row. Braxton Garrett, sneaky, their best pitcher this season for the full season. He's on the mound today. So I love that thunder sound. I love that thunder sound. I wish it could be my like alarm. Actually, that'd be a terrible alarm. So do we want to recap real quick what we got yeah. here in Thursday Thunder? Washington Mystics, money line. We got the Yankees plus one and a half on the run line. And the Tampa Bay Rays, minus one and a half. My friend was telling me the other day that our show needs a drinking game. Now I know, you know, people often listen to this show early in the morning. So I'm not encouraging you to drink early in the morning. Hey, unless it's your off day, baby. Get after it. Um, but drink responsibly if you are going to drink. But what do you think could be a drinking game for our show? It, like, anytime Mike is Mike. <laughs> well, I think we could do that. I, I Actually, it's funny. The Thursday Thunder sort of reminds me. Do, do you know the Thunder drinking game? Like the college drinking game Thunder? No. no. Okay, so, um, well, here, I'll look up. These are the specific rules. You had to look up the specific rules. Well, the specific you, rules because I want to be able to explain it to you. Have you actually done this? Yeah, I've, I've, only I've heard played of this. That no, 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 no. I've played this. I, I, I. I, I drink sometimes. <laughs> okay. uh, all right. So in this case, uh, for Thunder, so, so you take I'm the song uh, Hello, Thunderstruck <laughs> Thunderstruck by ACDC. Thunderstruck. I, I know some other people who ended up taking uh, whatever that Thunder song by Imagine Dragons is. Thunder. So, thunder hear, hear the, the thunder. thunder. Boom, boom. So you're saying anytime they so, say thunder? So you give all the players a drink, have them stand in a circle, and then start listening to Thunderstruck. The first time you hear thunder, the first person in the circle starts drinking. The next time you hear thunder, that person stops, and the person to their left Jeez. begins. So it's more and of a chug than I'm a, already than a shard. Yes. And I'm so, already you, so you repeat it until the end of the song. So what I was just thinking is, what if you just either took a shot or started drinking every time you hear the thunder go off in Thursday Thunder until you hear the next one? I think I, that might be a good one. If you're doing a shot, I'd say it gets hit probably like six or seven times per Nice Thursday little Thursday. Thunder. That's a nice. That's the way you're. Dude, Thursday. six or seven shots in a matter of what three minutes? Like uh, Thursday Thunder is not that. Long. You are hammered right now. <laughs> Happy hour. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> I mean, a chuggy. Okay, I get that. But shots. I've always hated in all the drinking games, like shots, like all the different ways you can consume alcohol. That's the one I hated the most. Like those chugging? drinking games where it's like you gotta. I, I, and I can't stop until the next. Like. The, it's I, like, hey, how about I drink on my own pace? Yeah, how about that? Ha exactly. I love one of the best evolutions of drinking games is beer pong nowadays is just all water cups. Back yep. in our day, it I, don't was know, I don't know about yep. you guys. Yes. Back in my day, Same. it was beer. It was gross. The it was ball the was dirty gross. cup. You throw yep. the ball in this disgusting cup of water, yep. and then the ball would come out clean, and you're like, oh, even though that water's gross, I'm still I'm cool with all this. Yeah. There's nothing that makes me feel more on the line of millennial and Gen Z than this because I've I've had both. I've had the you were it at started the with beer. It started with beer when I was Same. drinking at probably. A, Right. Drinking right at 21 years old, and then right. as it it 
uh, escalated from there. It became Statue water cups. Statue limitations is over, by the way. You can say that you drank it. So yeah, when I was underage drinking, it was all yeah. beer, and then after that, it became. But I love cups. it now. These kids got it great today. They oh. just have the drink in their hand. These kids. Sometimes, like, some places will put the beer on the side, but some people just have, like, you yeah. have your cup and mm-hmm. you take a sip. You have your like, own beer. Look, we're here for it's the great. competition. Who's actually playing beer pong to get hammered? It's like, yeah, I'll drink here and there, but I'm here to show you that I'm better at this than you. How about when you played bullets? You know what bullets are? Yeah. Okay, Jeremy, do you know what bullets are? I actually don't. For the t- for the people that don't listen, that don't know what bullets are, um, bullets is basically you have a can of beer and then you have a ping pong ball. And you have – it's basically the, the same setup as beer pong where you've got two people on one side, two people on yeah. the other side. And then you have to throw the ping pong ball and try to hit the beer can. If you do hit the beer can and it shoots off the other way, the person has to drink and chug that beer until somebody oh, gets yeah. the ping pong ball Hate and puts those. it on the table. Hate those. No, not for me, Clive. So that's that's the one where you're there trying to chug and then your buddy can't find the ball because oh. it's a party and people are kicking it around and you're just there sitting there chugging the whole time. I just not did easy. a wittyism. What do you think witty's doing right now? Probably chilling. Yeah. Taking shots to Thursday Thunder. Yeah. <laughs>